Hello, oh, this is how we jive from mass communication here I'm again with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Mac OS 26 public beta in your Mac Mini, MacBook Pro, or iMac. All the devices can support Mac OS Taco version, the public beta, beta 4, or any beta they are. So, in this process, you can go to system setting here, or you can go to Apple logo at the top. So in system setting here or at the down, go inside. So you inside in the system setting here, you will see automatic software update. If you click here, you will see the beta version available. This is public beta. You will not need any Apple developer account for this. If you don't see as this, then you have to go to general here, then software update, you have to click this one. If any case, if you don't see, here you have to check that automatic updates option is on or not. You have to on this one. All this option you have to activate. They may ask you password when you want to activate. So Mac OS update should be on in this. In some cases you have older version of computer. For example, Intel version of Mac. You may not able to install this beta. This is only for the Mac M1, M2, M3, M4 or other version. You have to check in the list. Okay, after checking all the things, you have to come here, you have two options, update tonight and restart now. So restart now, we're going to hit this one. But before doing this, please do a backup of everything because this is a beta version, you could have some problem. Now, I'm hitting restart now. You have to put your passwords. It's loading, installing, update. Use the Apple logo, it will restart a couple of times. You can go and do some other things meanwhile. Okay, now we'll hit continue button here. You can see welcome skin and get started at the bottom. So we are here inside. Let's see what we have new in this case. Looks little bit more sharper if I go down here. No big difference if I open here the setting option. So you see it look more beautiful here, the edges is more beautiful, you don't have more ugly black option if before it was. So the glass option, if you move here, you see it go more inside, more blurry effect, you have more glassy option. If you see at the edge, if I don't know, you can see properly, but look more at the glass finish, double edge, you can see here, and look more glassy, better than before, before it was opaque, dark, hard. But now more glassy effect. So another change you can see if you open here control center and you have to go hover to see the option to move. If you move from here you don't see any more in the control center. So this is one of the changes, not a big change you can see here. In the wallpaper section I see something beautiful, some new wallpaper may appear. See here we go to this section. In dynamic wallpaper, I click, looks this one day and night option. If I put this one, this one look beautiful, amazing. This one also different tone. So red at the night, red before, as I remember, they were all one color, if I'm not wrong on that. If I go to setting option in the appearance part, you can put default here. If you put default all the icon, taking time so they look more sharper before they were more as a glassy but now you can see you can read a little bit more then darker option you can see darker if you are put clear if you are coming from mac os 18.5 to this one you will see a big difference you will see a big difference of changes in icon and everything before you could never change the icon the tinted you can put different color look how beautiful the green and all this so you have to click and find if you are coming from beta 3 you will not see a big difference in this case. So this is the way you can update your Mac OS to the last version of beta that is beta 26 Taho or public beta. Okay guys if you like this video please do subscribe to my channel. If you like this segment please give me a thumbs up. Take care till then bye bye.